I hope it's not my father's blood. I guess it does make sense why. He oh my! Mm. Am I delusional? What? How's it going, everybody? My name is Nick. Otherwise, known as Blank Wanted Me Nine Three Five, and welcome to the Beast Inside. I think he's inside the door. Uh. <laughs> uh. Hopefully, you guys uh, are interested in more horror games because. That's what this is. It's meant to be a, like, uh, thriller slash survival horror game, right? And I don't really know anything about it outside of, apparently it says you play as, like, two different protagonists, so I'm assuming that means you just switch places of the two protagonists or whatever doing different things. Hey, buddy. You want to come on out? How you doing, buddy? Okay. No, you stay in your room. It's fine. Um, but... Otherwise, I know nothing about it. I don't know anything about the story or anything. So this is going to be... I don't know how long the game is. I didn't look at any of that. So I don't know. But I'm going to get right into it. Also, actually, I know I said I'm going to get right into it. Let me give a little disclaimer. I know this this week I was supposed to be doing a difficult game about climbing. Because I said I was going to be going back and forth, right? I have been playing for 30 minutes this morning. I can not reach that next jump. And I'm not going to do another recording where 90% of it is me doing one jump, okay? So, I I just basically said I quit for today. Um, I don't know when I'm going to have another episode of it out. Because it makes me so mad and I can't get that jump. So, it's probably going to be one of those things where I have to practice over and over and over again. And apparently that one mixed with a wheel that's coming up after that are two of the hardest jumps. So, if I can't get that jump, I'm definitely not going to get the next jump. And I'm just never going to get anywhere, so... Anyways, that's enough about a game that makes me mad. Let's get into a game that makes me scared. Uh, for those who don't, who want to know the story and balance level of puzzles and action elements, and for those who want bigger challenge. See, I'm thinking of just doing standard. Uh, I typically just try to do the standard, so. All right, so let's see what this game's gonna be about, huh? My beard's all scraggly, but it's not long enough to really tame yet. <laughs> I suppose I could just keep it really short, but I want to see what I would look like with a full beard, you know? Then again, knowing how long it tends to take to grow in the patchy areas like here. I still have, like, there's no hair here. I don't know why. And that's not me asking for products to use. <laughs> I want it to be natural. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay. Where? Where am I? I don't know. Why? What's going on? God. Why? Adam. Adam! What are you doing? Why are you stalking us? Is this about Adam's work? What do you want from us? Why are you tormenting my family? No! Adam! Is that Adam? No. No, what have you done to Adam? Oh, God. Uh, I'm pretty sure I beheaded him and stabbed him in the brain. Of course, for a casualty. No, there is no war. We're just a, we're just a regular family. Oh. We're here we just wanted to live our life, and you ruined everything. Pictures, bugs, threats, and now you've killed me. Stay away! Don't! They already know about you. They've been watching the house. They won't let you. Hush. No! What are you doing? What are you doing? I am sitting the front line. Huh? One week earlier. Okay. Well, I guess we know the ending of that family. Death. The sweep of the past. President Carter had commented on the Russian threat that we could use. Wow. Do 
further we go, the more doubts I have. It will be challenging, true. But it was you who kept saying you'd like you to get zip away up, from lady. the city. Feel the call of the Can't wild. you tell I'm looking through this character's weekend, eyes? Honey, not for the rest of our lives. Are they married <laughs> or just it's for the rest of dating. our lives. Really, Emma? We don't know the day or the hour. <sighs> Very funny. Like we don't hear enough about nuclear threats in the media. That's what I'm talking about. If I don't break the code, this country would be like a basket full of nuclear mushrooms. Adam, stop it. But then again, what? maybe this shack will fall down on us before Brezhnev's... Is he actually talking about his or job, or is he just joking no about shack. nukes? It's a present from your parents, and you should appreciate it. Take a look! Oh, it looks even better than the photos. I don't want to skip this. I accidentally hit a button. I should keep my hand off the keyboard until oh, I'm ready to play. Oh, our stuff made it here before us. And those lazy movers didn't even bother waiting for us. That's okay. We can bring it all in ourselves. Yeah, meaning I toil away when you give orders from the shower. I mean... Sounds like the husband thing Three to do. drive and we're finally here. The place seems peaceful and quiet. Is he actually recording Maybe he'll his help me to focus on talking this about his vacation? To decipher. Honey, oh, he actually there. does have a job uh, deciphering thousand. stuff. Update. The place seems peaceful and quiet until Emma showed up. <laughs> I love that. Hey, I didn't even see the door open. What? Uh, wow, this is kind of nice. Home sweet home. Pretty. That's trash. Oh, the boxes are over there. Did he say moving, guys? So they're moving in? Or is this temporary? I can't tell. I feel like it's meant to be temporary. Like, maybe the whole thing is he's just... What? Okay. Well, hang on a minute. Um... So, what I'm getting out... I mean, I'm only a couple seconds in, so... Or, like, a couple minutes in, so I shouldn't be speculating too much. But I feel like the whole idea is that he's just going to be here temporarily to get away from everything to focus Gotta on get those boxes what he's inside. doing. Honey, don't just stand there. Those boxes won't carry themselves in. Okay. I should put the box on a table upstairs. Oh. What? Oh, that's neat table upstairs uh which table oh she's showering in there I guess and that's also locked okay which table does he mean not in there, obviously. Oh, wait. Here it is. No. What? The box is where it should be. Time to paint the walls. I think there's some paint in the attic. What, what about the other boxes? What? Okay, where's the attic door, then? Oh, my goodness! Oh, that makes sense. Damn, I can't reach it. I need something to pull down the stairs. Oh, that makes sense. Yep, thank you. Oh, I guess I don't have to activate it. Okay. Hello? Ah! Leave me alone! You've got to be kidding me. Fuck. Um, the baby hears everything. <laughs> oh, she oh, like a great agent, just like Dad. Honey, I can't get in the goddamn attic without a key. Check the dining room. It should be in a drawer. Oh my goodness! So many chores, woman. As if there was one drawer. The key could be in one what of the drawers. What do we got here? A thinking woman's guide to pregnancy. Okay. It's not a nightmare, even if it looks like one. Thinking woman's guide to... Yeah, I know that. Can I open it? Open? 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 All right. Cool. Get away. 
Okay. Where did she say it would probably be? Oh, is she brushing her teeth or something? Alright. Got a note. Okay. Adam, our dearest son, this house belonged to our family for many decades. Some even called it the Stevenson's Refuge. Uh, but when me and your dad moved to Boston, we thought Grandpa's just gonna sell it, and he said he would. Well, he didn't. Surprisingly, he left it for us in his will. And now you and your lovely wife will live here, raise your kids, and simply enjoy life far away from the turmoil of our dangerous time. I can't even imagine a better place to settle down. Take good care of Emma. We'll visit you sometime next month if my aching hip allows that. Mom. P.S. Dad thinks he should be the one uh, come up with a name for your son or daughter. I have no idea why he's insisting on that. Maybe he's just getting old and tries to leave some kind of legacy. Anyway, act surprised when he mentions it to you. Okay, I mean, why why would you tell me that if you want me to be surprised? Also, um, no, that's not going to happen. Thank God I can work remotely now, so I don't have to set my alarm for 6 a.m. So, okay, so you're just going to straight up live out here, which is, which is cool and all, but how far away from town are you? Like, are you just going to get all your groceries in one massive trip? Hang on, where am I going now? Uh... The box is where it should be. Time to paint the walls. I think there's some paint in the attic. Yeah, I don't remember... Notes? No. Where's the key, though? I didn't see it. To be fair, I didn't look that closely. Uh, no, I can't open that. Didn't she say it would be down here, though? By the way, Adam, uh, I hate to break the news to you, but you're going to be dying soon. Where did you say I it was? That goddamn attic with a key. I know. Where was it? What? This one looks unhappy. Don't worry, little buddy. You've got wings. You can always fly away to a nicer place, unlike me. Well, well, well that's sad. You're not, you're not happy with your wife? Are you in a sad marriage? Clarence's parents had a real good marriage? I paid those bastards in advance, so of course they didn't even bother to take those boxes to the attic. You can't trust anyone these days. Simon and Sons Moving Service. How much did you pay them? Whatever. Dude, where's the key? What? Dude, I'm very confused. The game just started, and I'm already wondering where the hell this key is. <laughs> nope, not in there. What the fuck? Pardon my language, but where's this darn key? Nope, nothing in here. I guess I'll be I'll be a good visitor in your brain and I'll close all the drawers for you. Probably not gonna be in that one. I guess I could double. I can't find it in the dining room. Oh, sorry. I, I guess I didn't get it from the trunk. Oh, <sighs> typical. <laughs> well <laughs> Are you guys married? I couldn't tell. What? Hello? Oh. Uh, hey, close your door, sir. You don't need to let all the bugs in. Hey! Finally, got the key. Go, go, go! Wait, close your trunk! I'm on my way! I'm on my way, I'm on my way, I'm on my way. Ah, 
What do we got here? Uh, dancing couple figure. Rotate the hidden message. I wonder who they belong to. Grandma or grandpa or someone else. Okay. Um, little, little doll. Uh, an angel. Looks like he's sleeping, but he might as well be dead. Poor guy. Life has been rough on him. How long has he laid here? Probably for like a century. Someone must have, uh, hit him really hard to make his legs fall off. Wait, is that blood or paint? Good question. Um... I'll worry about that later. Just a bunch of stuff on the ground. Okay. I know I'm looking for paint, and I, I see it, but I'm curious if there's other stuff like notes or something. Damn it. Hmm, what's that? What kind of grip is that? A what? plank. Someone's hidden something under the floor. I'm gonna pry it up. Maybe I can find a crowbar somewhere. Um, okay. Where would you find a crowbar, though? Dude, do I not bring the keys with me when I'm starting to move? Whoa. Broken TV. Dude, this place is kind of a mess. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like a crowbar would be downstairs, too. No. Any crowbar? Crowbar. Where are you, crowbar? I mean, don't need that. Are you still brushing your teeth? Dang. You just really want to make sure you're hygienic. Where would I find a crowbar? Would I have one in the trunk? Nope. Much, much later. I don't want to break my fingers. I better check if there's a crowbar in the attic somewhere. So I guess it is in the attic. But I didn't see it. In the end, if you guys have watched any of my stuff, you'd know that I tend to be pretty frickin' blind, so... Wait. Open! Open! That's unfortunate. Um... Oh, what? Oh my goodness. I didn't even see the ladder. Open! What could it be? A treasure? Hope it's not great grandpa's porn man. <laughs> the ankles! You can see the ankles! I have to break the cipher to open the box. Um. Okay, so an excerpt from wait, rotate objects to find hidden messages to reveal the message. Well, okay, M H P A O. I got that. Um, H P. A. Where's O? What? Wait, was it not O? Wait, hang on. Okay, so when the examination mode is on, you can perform additional interactions with certain objects. 
This device will help me decode the letters in the text. Oh, I see. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Okay. So, disk. So, so W, R, Z, W, R, Z, K, W, R, Z, K, Y. Okay. I think I got it. Or not. Hang on. I might need to do something else. So, notes mixed with the... So... Hang on. Maybe it's the bottom one then. So... Hang on. What was the note again? It was M-H-P-A-O. <laughs> I'd have to be a goddamn code breaker to... Wait, isn't that what I do for a living? <laughs> Bruh! You're an idiot. M-H-P-A-O. Alright, so... I guess it's the other way then. So, C... C, X... C, X, F... C, X, F, Q... C, X, F, Q, E. C, X, F, Q, E. Maybe. C... No? What? How do I enter detective mode? M-H-P-A-O. Some characters in Caesar's letter look different. If I can find them all... M-H-P-A-O. W... Wait, hang on. So... Yeah, so it's just a shift of a certain amount. So... W R Z K Y W R Z K Y W R Z K Y Is that not it? Okay, hang on, so, M-H-P-A-O, let's try this one, a different way, M, so C, X, F, C, X, F, C, X, F, Q, C, X, F, Q, E, C, X, F, Q, E. Whoa, CXFQE. So, CXFQE, CXF. No? So the other one was closer. What am I doing wrong? I'm very confused. Yeah, so obviously these letters correlate. If J equals C, then based on the letter, the first character in the cipher should be... If J equals C... How do you get that? How'd you get J equals C? Wait. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. J equals C. 
Ha! That's that's cool. All right. Okay. M H P A O. So hang on. I should. Ah, eh, it's fine. It's not enough letters right now. M H P A O. Uh, uh M. Wait. I think Q. Right. J equals C. So F. Okay. I am gonna write this down. Hang on, guys. So M H P A O. I didn't realize I could turn the outside. So. Where's M? So, F. Under the sea. Under the sea. Darling, it's better. Uh, A. P. I. A. T. Oh, is it going to be faith? It's faith. Okay. Okay. I got it now, I think. Got it! Holy jeez. Okay. Definitely taking the key. That was Aren't rough. Nicholas. <laughs> It is September 27th in the year of our Lord, 1864. Evening, almost. Wait, what? I want to read it. Uh, uh, evening, almost night. Never before have I kept a diary, but they say that it might be a chance for me to reclaim the memories I have lost. Besides, writing entails a clarity of thought. It makes it easier to distinguish facts from imagination. Okay. Someone's going to come try to kill us tonight. You didn't see anything, right? It is September 27th in the year of our Lord. Oh, this is the other person I'm playing as. Evening, almost night. Never before have I kept a diary, but they say that it might be a chance for me to reclaim the memories I have lost. Besides, writing entails a clarity of thought makes it easier to distinguish facts from imagination. I'm home again after 10 years absence. I'm relieved to find the house unscathed. That's good. It's the only roof I have over my head for now. Okay. I should light some candles and take a look around. No trace of my father. Did I honestly think he would welcome me at the door? Just a decade ago, without so much as leaving a letter. Okay. The house feels strange, even though it has not changed one. Wait, thing. am I gonna run out of these? I should there probably be careful with fears these. Fears creeping out of the darkness, whose source I cannot define. Hey, Memories I'll take that. Up. That's what they told me. Maybe then I will realize what happened to my father. Whoa. Press tab to read the diary. Nicholas writes down his thoughts as well as all important information. Okay, so it's similar to the recorder. Jacob and Nicholas. May 12th, 1843. Uh, he reproached me for making faces and not standing straight. Although he was uh, the one who couldn't stand still. As you can tell... He gave me a good thrashing, even though I didn't deserve it. Well, that's unfortunate. No. They're all locked. Alright. I still don't know why my father started to collect them. Okay. Maybe he just has some hobbies you don't know about, okay? Holy fuck! Upstairs. What could it be? Damn whip. I, I thought the window was bolted shut. Ah! Hey, what are you doing here? I hate how that this got me. This is private me. property. Ah! Who the devil is he? 
I got jump scared twice in a matter of like a second, and that makes me so mad. Where the hell did he go? Hey! You still here? I'd better take a look. You don't need to. He pointed at the shed. Maybe I can find something in there. Okay. Ooh, how's this? Um. Strange. The light is coming from the inside, but the door's locked? Maybe I can find something to cut through the chain. Okay. Uh, all the other times the item has either been told to me where it was, okay, or it's been around there, so... That's, that's nice. Um. What the hell is this? Uh, newspaper clipping. Uh, the terrible crime shocked the peaceful local community. The deputy sheriff called to the inn, confirmed the man's death. John Norton has, uh, huh? John Norton has been considered missing the last few weeks. The assailant was exceptionally brutal. The victim's throat was slashed, and many other cuts and burns all over his body suggest prolonged torture. A murder? Here? John Norton. Sounds familiar. Okay, is there any... Holy... Mm. Did I see that right? Hang on. Am I seeing stuff? Was there actually a guy there? A shadow of a guy? Is there any... That's my father's hat. Basement. Basement? Did he leave this as some kind of clue for me? I should look into it. Uh, can I take a weapon? I'll take matches. I don't feel like looking for that vagabond in the dead of night. I'd better go home. Well, you also were talking about going to look in the basement, so... Oh, there was something over there. Or there used to be. Please tell me that's you, father. What? You let yourself in? Hey, are you deaf? I'm talking to you. I don't think I want to go near him. But I feel like I... You know what? You stay over there. I'll stay over here. We'll be fine. It's a chilly night, isn't it? That candle must really help keep you warm. I have a kerosene uh, thing in front of me to help me out, you know? It's really weird how there's some trumpets playing. I don't know where they're coming from. Do you? I'd rather be in an asylum. No, never mind. Asylums back then sucked. Okay, so he said basement. This is one of my mom's favorites. She got it from a friend of the family. My father didn't like it, though it meant something. Though it meant something. Thought it meant something in a bad way. It was a gift from my father's partner, George, as far as I remember. Fate played a cruel trick on him back when I was a kid. It still gives me the creeps. I can open doors on my own, you know. You don't need to do it for me. Boy. 
I hate you. I hope you know that. I just, I hate you. My father never could express emotions, but when he felt unhappy, he used to clutch this little angel in his hand. How kind. Chair. Move. That's not disturbing. Oh no, not at all. That's... Where did all this blood come from? Dear God. Where's that noise coming from? Or what door? Someone barricaded the front door? No, never mind. That was just a trick of the light. Wait, wasn't I supposed to go this way though? I see, I see. I don't want to see, but I do see. It's a terrible idea. Terrible idea, Clarence. Motherfucker, I just told you it was a bad idea. You're seeing ghosts, dude! Stop! Oh my goodness, you're the stereotypical white chick in the freaking horror movies that has to go check everything out! <laughs> Ma'am, I heard you crying from over there. Is everything okay? Do you need me to get some help? Anything? Should I take the crowbar? Hi, horse. How you doing, horsey? Alright, I guess I gotta go towards where the ghost was, huh? I don't like those pictures staring at me in the distance. Hi. Is there anything behind you? No? Okay. You can go back up. <clears throat> or just fall down. That's fine. Maybe there's another way in. Oh, yeah. I'm sure there is. Oh, that's not right. I need more kerosene. Can I take you? <sighs> okay. Hillside Inn is now open. 40 comfortable rooms. A cozy refuge at the heart of a mountain village. Delicious meals. Near the famous Caroline Pyrite Mine. Don't delay. Visit today. Okay. Cool. I'll definitely take more kerosene. No, throw that. That don't matter. What? Hang on. Is that another way in? Is it not over here? I'm 
I'm gonna run out of kerosene at this point, so I have to... Oh. Damn it, I can't open it. Maybe there's something in my briefcase that would help get it open. I have to get in there. Whatever happened. I hope it's not my father's blood. I guess it does make sense why- Oh my- mm. Am I... delusional? Hmm. I hate you. I hate you. I- I hate you so much. like roots I need to get rid of them before I leave the basement I hate you I hate you I hate you He's upstairs What does he want from me Where's my briefcase? I feel like I have to go up here for my briefcase. What are you doing? Has someone gone through my briefcase? My parents' old house, where Emma and I decided to move, hides more secrets than I can imagine. Under one of the floorboards in the attic, I discovered a hidden journal from one, of, from one Nicholas Hyde. Reading it absolutely froze my blood. I don't know if the chilling passages describe real-life events, or if they are just mad ravings made up by this Nicholas person. We're about to find out, aren't we? <laughs> oh, that was so rough. Okay. Well, that was fun. Alright, let's do this little cutscene and then we'll go from there. Damn it, someone must have torn out the rest of the pages. Honey, are Strange. you there? I was in the attic and I'll show the diary to Emma. She might find it interesting. Well, that sounds like a a next week thing. Oh my goodness, this is fun. I hope you guys are are gonna enjoy this because I uh, I'm definitely gonna play more of this. This was very scary, but a lot of fun. Um, I'm I'm so intrigued as to what's going on here and what's gonna happen later, you know. But in the end, um, this is probably gonna be my new series now that Bioshock's done. So hope you guys are enjoying. If you did, if you stuck around this long, it seems like you are enjoying, please consider check out some of our other content. And until next time, I will see you guys later. Deuces.